Pakistan is an old world civilization with a rich history of rich art and culture. Mangoes, citruses, Indus dolphins, the incense of Sufi shrine, spices, and gems, it encompasses so many contradictory things within it that you will have to visit it to experience it in its true complexity and beauty. Nothing in Pakistan is subtle, there is intensity in every corner of every village where every mural is embellished, from architecture, so ancient, yet so astonishingly elaborate that even the most modern visitor can't help but look in awe to the stunning jewelry its women wear. Craftsmanship in Pakistan comes has sprung out of artisans who weave myths, legends, and Sufi stories into different forms of crafts indigenous to every area. There are many different worlds contained within the geographical boundaries of Pakistan as various civilizations impacted it at different times in its history. The world of its craftspeople, with their handmade goods and textiles, spans millennia and encompasses influences of many civilizations Indus, Persian, and Turkic within it. For artisans of Pakistan, wood, metal, marble, clothes, clay was canvases for their creativity, happiness had to be carved out of chaos and often creativity was the only outlet so the brave artisans of Pakistan's deserts and mountains painted tiles, carved marble, made cupboards from wood and molded brass into toys for children and hit copper into utensils for their daughter's wedding. In some areas, the village itself is linked with craft whether it's wood carving style or rugs or embroidery or metalwork or blue pottery that has gone on for generations, taught from father to son or mother to daughter. Wood carving was inspired by the elaborate Mughal architecture, Brave artisans working in small cities are still creating furniture pieces fit for a king in places like Chiniot and Sargodha.